Hi guys, welcome back. This is the video that I have been waiting to do for a while. It's my Christmas wish list, and I guess we have to decide if I've been naughty or nice this year. So let's see, what, what did I do this year, Santa? Um, first of all, I finished my master's degree. I'd say that's pretty nice. Um, got a house, that's pretty nice. I think I was a pretty good girl, so I think I deserve everything on my list. What do you guys think? <laughs> well, um, let's see. The things on my list this year, I have a lot of eyeshadow palettes that I really want, so um, if I don't get them as gifts, I'll probably go ahead and buy those myself with the gift cards or um, my own money after the holidays, but I've been really wanting the Lorac Unzipped Palette for a while. I want the Too Faced um, Semi Sweet Chocolate Bar Palette a lot. I want the original Lorac Pro palette. I have the Lorac Pro 2, but I really like the Lorac Pro. Um, and I would love some more Makeup Forever Artist eyeshadows that I'll make it in my own palette. I also asked for the ColourPop eyeshadows. Um, there's a couple of kits, so I asked for some of those. And I also asked for um, the Makeup Geek eyeshadows and to make my own palette. So. Apparently I like eyeshadows a lot because those are all eyeshadow products. Uh, the next thing I would say is lippies. So I asked for a set from ColourPop Cosmetics, their lippy set, and it had um, dual ended, I think it was five of them, uh, dual end lippy sticks. There was like the lippy on one end and the liner on the other, and there were five colors um, with the coordinating liners that matched. And I think that was $20 or $30, $30, I don't know. And then um, I want the NARS Audacious Lipsticks. I've been wanting those for a while, but they're pretty pricey. I think they're like $29, something like that each. Yeah, so I haven't bought any of them. Um, I've had them in my cart so many times, and then they sell out, or I change my mind, or I say, oh, I'll buy those later, and I never do. So that would be wonderful. Um, I also would love to try some more of the YSL or Dior lipsticks. Um, I've been eyeing more of the Tarte blushes like Exposed that I hear a lot about, and also Blushes by Becca. Um, I think there's one like Songbird, and there's another one that I've really been wanting. I would love the Becca highlighters. I have um, one of them. I have it in Opal, but I would love to get that in Moonstone or um, any of the Shimmering Skin Perfectors, just the liquid highlighters that came in that trio set. Uh, I also want a ton of brushes. I wouldn't mind duplicates from my e.l.f. brushes because those are awesome, but there are a lot of Sephora brushes that I'm interested in getting. More recently, I've been getting into using a foundation brush, and then I only have, I think I have two or three, and they're all different, and I like them, but they're dirty. Like, after I use them twice, I'm like, ah, so I have to wash my brushes more than once a week in order to be able to use a foundation brush every day. So I would love to get a couple of those. I want the OMG brush from IT Cosmetics at Ulta, um, and a couple of other foundation brushes that I've seen out there that look pretty good. Um, there's another Sigma foundation brush. I have the F80 Flat Kabuki, but there's another one out there that seems really good. Um, also non-beauty related, um, I've been wanting some stuff to serve for um, like gatherings and stuff like dishes that, you know, will serve chips and dip or a layered, like a three-tier layered um, thing to serve little desserts or appetizers on when you entertain, things like that, um, like a platter um, and also you know, some long teaspoons, and I know that sounds silly because I don't really drink tea that much, but um, to give them for like inside the jar of salsa to like clean out the bottom of the jar because I go through a lot of salsa here. I live in Phoenix, come on. Um, as close to Mexico as you can get, we're a few hours away. But um, I also have been wanting um, a lot of like jewelry and accessories in general, hair accessories. Uh, I would love a new curling wand, a new straightener, the deep waver. Um, I am the easiest person to buy for. I love OPI nail polishes. So those are the things on my wish list. I'm curious to see what you guys have on your wish list. Um, obviously I love the holidays for more reasons than just presents, but presents are pretty cool. Like they're pretty nice. Um, I tend to get really into it. I do my shopping really early and then I'm sad it's over, but you know, I like to spread it out budget wise. It just makes more sense. I start my shopping in September and I'm finished by Black Friday usually. So um, that is it for now. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please comment below with what items are on your wish list and if you have some of the same ones that I do. I completely understand. Um, I hope you guys have a great holiday. Spend some time with your family. Eat some awesome food. Some sugar cookies for sure. I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.